Welcome everybody. I'm gonna be doing some digital characters today. This is a commission for the South Florida Role Model Foundation. I'm gonna be putting together a little bit of uh, a layout for um, for this wonderful crew. It's gonna be four people. It's gonna be this guy right here. One two three and four and they're all going to be you know just doing something uh problem for me i just want to like have them be like very sort of friendly they know they've known each other for a long time so i'm going to see uh what i come up with but i have an idea in my head and i would like to uh try and execute that so you guys can uh, hang out with me and if you would like to support me you guys are welcome to purchase badges that's greatly appreciated um and here we go. So I'm just gonna, just gonna see what we're working with. I'd like to check out my brushes. This guy right here is good. Okay, cool. Calibrated brushes, awesome. I'm simply going to create the face outline with the brown. I'm gonna make sure it looks like his eyes. So I gotta go back and forth to see where I'm positioning stuff. I'll also turn the brightness up on this a little bit so you guys can see it much better. Hello to everybody, what's up? I'm gonna go ahead and just jump right into the eyebrow. Interesting, his mouth here. Again, this is just the beginning stage. This is a commission, so I'm just taking the steps to uh, start it up. interesting the control difference between a marker an actual marker and the iPad it's interesting too the way his face is like it looks like he's smiling you know it, it kind of does look like he's he's smiling although he kind of isn't but he is at the same time it's like the mona lisa smile where she you know no one can really tell whether she's smiling or you know frowning or something you know being sad is what do you guys think hello everybody hello hello resi you can do it <laughs> saludos saludos you guys um uh, Make sure you check out my YouTube. We finally went ahead and hit a thousand subscribers. I am stoked, stoked for everybody to go over there and check out what uh, what I post. Um, and 
will be posting more per week given that I've done so much on Instagram that I have all this content. So you guys will see a few of the same, but also a few that are not on Instagram. There's a drawing hour specifically that um, Instagram did not, uh, does not have. So I, I have it on my YouTube. Uh, okay. Oh, interesting. So how do there we go? I need this guy. Some people say this is cheating. <laughs> what do you think? Is this cheating? That's the tool, baby. That's the tool, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That's the advantage. That's what you got to realize, right? Okay. So I feel like he's got a large eye, eye bags here, but he's got a very pronounced nose and very pronounced lips. So, I, you know, I feel like everything is big on his face. Sorry, you can't see it because of the comments. Okay. We'll see it from over here. How about that? And um, so we'll have to figure out what we want to actually be the caricature for him, you know? So they also want it to be kind of a character. So it can't just be a caricature and, and that's it. It's got to be a character. So I'm doing all that in one layer. So let's see what we come up with here. A slippery surface. Question is, does he want the bandana up there? Looks like, send me the photo. I'm gonna put it just like the photo. See the eyebrows and this area is way bigger on the face than on here. So maybe we gotta tone down the face. Make the face much more narrow and closer to the features. So let's see. Let's just do one of these. Boom. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to work that way. Let's see if we can do this. We're going to go right from. Still. High cheekbones. Come on, Alan. He was good. Filling it out, filling it out. Yes, okay, let me just, let me just loosen up. Loosen up, loosen up. See what comes from that. Ah, that's why I don't use that 
too much. Okay, so let's just say we've got one in place. There we go. We're getting him. We're getting him more and more. Cool. <laughs> yeah, I know. I feel like a newbie using this stuff. Although, like, I've I've done some other digital work before. It's weird. Plus, I'm trying to get acquainted with the camera being right there. Rotate a little bit. Rotate. Guys, let's rotate. Okay. Have to change the air my way. And we're back at it. Okay, cool. So let's just say that that is the first face. And we're going to do the second face. Face a number at all. Serious guy over here. My gosh. Next, I'm just kidding. <laughs> cool. So, obviously, he's got some uh, high brows, thick brows. Serious guy also here. Uh, I feel a lot more comfortable all of a sudden. That's weird. Was 
there's like a weird delay on the application of the line. Here's the other one. There's a little bit of a thing going on with his mouth that I didn't quite get. <clears throat> so I feel like I gotta keep working this one um, a little bit. Let's move the nostril a tad bit higher to make sure that nose is kind of pointing. Those lines are just su suggestion lines. They're not gonna actually be in the caricature here. Um, but I gotta put them in because I, you know, I want to see where I'm gonna be doing the shading and stuff like that. Let's see. There's okay. So there's no smile. That's what that is. Yeah, it's like more of a comes down and stops right about there. wrapping around the bottom lip and kind of going in like this instead hey <laughs> yeah that's better okay I'm happy with that oh, we got to put a little thing here and might as well do it with my finger jeez there's that there's another one over here we're gonna go ahead and fine tune this a little bit right now. I don't wanna wait. It's gonna do a lot of those. A few of those. Is my hair in the way? You let me know if it is. Just start yelling, hey, move your head. <laughs> cool, so let's move on to the next one. Next phase. This one, oh yeah, this is the good stuff right here. So this one I'm gonna need to use technique on because 
the angle is not my forte. That's a upward looking angle. Come on, pencil. Work. Stop being lazy. Okay, so we got this head over here. That's too much. getting his likeness a little bit. I need to cut this up a little bit over here to come down. Let's actually go ahead and fine tune this one right now. I'm simply going to take this layer and bring down the opacity. And then I'm gonna just go on a layer above it. Um, and I'm gonna use that same color just to keep it nice and consistent with the other ones. Okay, so we've got an ear that is lower, uh, I'd say about lower than the pupil but just a tad higher than the bottom of the eye. So it's about, it's about where it needs to be. But we got to move this eye over a little bit. They're a little bit more separated kind of eyes. So as I look back and forth, I can see the differences. And also there's some curvature and things that I'm just going to keep from the front. I'm not talking now saying anything about the drawing but um, it's, it's trying to feel the movement of my hand so that I can consciously while I draw these lines get used to uh, drawing again on the tablet here so, okay so I like to just go and do one line and so that's why I practice that Let's see if we can make that line happen that's the distance from the back of the bottom lip to the front it's very interesting but that's what I see all right so let's see how it's looking so far yeah it's looking like not much at all okay cool um, cool so this is the initial phase no pun intended um, this is the initial uh, part of this project um, to, to get their likeness um, because once you get the likeness you can do whatever you want with the face and body you know or rather with the with that head that you make 
um, and attach it to a body from there. And those eyes are giving me problems. Let's see, I might need to turn this opacity down a little more so I can see it a little better. What do you guys think? Do you do you think that what is the like if you had difficulties drawing, what are the difficult parts for you? Um, are the eyes, the nose, the mouth? What is the most difficult feature for you to draw? Put that down, down in the comments on the IGTV when you watch this. you know that's one thing that an artist can do is, is we can this is something that I just thought of um, we can draw it traditionally and then just put it in the computer and color it in pretty much you can do that I've done that on um, on several occasion with that pharmacy uh, illustration that I did where they were donating masks and they wanted the whole staff to represent the company um, in the illustration. And I went ahead and drew it um, on my sketchbook and then I drew it and then I took that illustration and put it on the computer or rather the iPad it's interesting how the eyebrows change the entire meaning of his phases and the entire mood as uh, was affected, you know, totally, you know, made more not so mad um, anymore. So keep that in mind when you're drawing something. Okay, we're 
getting there, guys. We're getting there. See how it looks without the uh, extra stuff back here. Yeah, that's that's it's a little bit like them right there. Something up with this eye over here. I feel like it might be too close. First of all, that's just the start of the problem. Let's see. Is it this one? Yeah. seeing the movement movement tells me that this eye needs to pop out right about here and movement also tells me that well now that we have that one let's look I'm gonna just sit back a little bit look at that uh, okay there's the circle needs to tuck in a little more on this side This one is totally off. Well, not quite totally, but you know, this is definitely in need of some help here. So this line is going to go a lot more straight. This is going to arch or taper a little more. That you can do that now. It didn't used to be that you can uh, you can switch it like that. Okay. So with that being said, I'm gonna take this off. Yeah, that's looking better. Cool. Hello to Malaysia. Aaron Razali is saying hello to Ira uh, hello from Malaysia. Let's see who else we got here. Where are you guys from? España en la casa. Eduagon 96 Saludos a España Si, sí, hablo español Habla es con H, mamá uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. A ver, ¿quién más? Si, sí, si, sí, if you would like to get a drawing done Let me know in the si quieren que le haga una caricatura, déjenme un mensaje, un directo, mándenme un directo. 
if you would like to get a caricature done um, just send me a direct message actually put it in a separate layer just so that I can have it divided but cool all right that's that's the uh, second one that one's not going in this one. Oh, here we go guy with the hat and the chain that's kind of like what you would want to notice like right, right away what what are the things that they care about enough to put it on there um, and send and get a, take a photo with it so uh, to put it on on, on as accessories like hats you know, earrings, you know, even the shirt, usually they would want, you know, pe guests, people uh, in general would want the uh, accessories in there. So let's go ahead and add one more layer. Take, uh, take this off. All right, cool. We're ready to start the next photo. All right, we got some beautiful flags flailing in here. Blue with a star in the center from Avocado, 4349. I love that. Me equals we. I love that. I appreciate that. Wait a minute. How do you know about the we? That's awesome. They, they actually have that in their mission. Unless unless they shared it with you, <laughs> I appreciate you being here. Thanks so much, Mary. Mary, Mishadzi. We got Omid. We got Andre. We got Kireji from Puerto Rico. Rasia, Rasia. Ha! I know what you're saying. <laughs> But Dean for for uh, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to drop Putin at some point. Yeah, he's right. Cagdela Andre. Weba, move your head. <laughs> okay, thanks for letting me know, Kireji. <laughs> I, my head was in the way. I didn't know. My bad. I didn't know. Now I know. Hello, Yuresi. You want to be live? Oh man, I, 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 If I wanna, if I wanna save this to my phone, I can't do it. If I, you know, if I do the, the live with someone else, I can't. I can't save it to my phone then. perfectly right what do you think this movement right here is harder than you think but definitely try it so you can feel what I mean Did I get them or did I get them? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> oh man. From Russia. What's up, Russia? Argentina in la casa. South Africa in the house. El Salvador. El Salvador. San Salvador. Saludos a todos por allá. Cagdela. Be mad. Be mad. <laughs> Minya Zavud Alani Priyadna Pusna Komitsa
Где ты вел собой? No, it's a. Uh, uh, где где тебя работают? Я, я работаю в парке. Сейчас я работаю в арт студио. Okay, so now that we've got a little bit of a layout, I think we'll go ahead and, and get a little bit more serious with it. Um, I mean, this is a fun start, but you know, I don't know that the client is going for this look. So I'm gonna go ahead and try a different version right on top of this one, just to kind of, you know, I, I have some things that I want in the spot that I want them, so. Sometimes guys have those lashes, you know, we've got to put them in there. This guy, you know, they, they, um, all, the, all these guys are very dedicated to helping um, others and also, you know, and bettering the interaction from people and, you know, bettering the relationship between the police and between the police and the people. bit of a, a pretty boy in the sense like he, he wants to look really good in his photos which is cool um, so we're trying to capture that uh, you know without messing it up Let's see what we can do here all right see the center I'm looking at the center of, of this so I want that center to be sort of forward in relation to the center of the line center comes back in there behind the nose and then forward here down and so on so that's where the center is there and then okay so that's what it is this part right here needs to move as well and that's where we're gonna that's this center here so about here is where front of that is, and this is the back as it wraps around this way, okay, cool, so now we got the other side of the face,
feel like that I can use some change. Try to do it in one motion if you can. Let's see, man, difficult little line for sure. There we go. Still looks a little odd. Let me see. What is it? What is happening? It's down, up, left, right, left, right. B A B A. Select. Start. Got it. All right. That's it. That's the, that's the code. I figured it out. Now I get my 30 illustration lives. <laughs> This eye just needs to all together be redone. of it being there rather than actually putting it in. All right, cool. And we're going to just do some facial hair, a little bit more thinly here. Nice job, Apple Pencil. Man, you're coming together quickly. Again, these are suggestion lines so that I can kind of gather what that's looking like. Cool, so I think that's it. I think we uh, got his, his face. And yes, we're gonna finish the shirt. Boom. Um, so that would be the beginning of this project and hopefully you guys enjoyed that process um, definitely leave a leave a comment below with the feature that you find most difficult to draw in your opinion as an artist you know I'm sure I feel like everyone watching here is an artist so what is your most difficult feature to draw put it down in the comments below when this airs in the IGTV much love to you all, and we will see you in the near future to color this up and have, well, probably to do the bodies next. All right, so I'm going to end this one here, and we'll see you guys next time.